Hello YouTube, A7X or Robert Kuhn, A7X here, and as you can see in the mat in front of me, this is going to be an opening for Realm of the Sea Emperor, the new water-themed structure deck. And before I get to my opening, I'd just like to say I'm happy that we're getting a new water deck. I've always loved water-themed decks and anything water-related. I'm just a guy who loves water. And, uh, actually the second deck I ever made in, uh, what should we call it, in Yu-Gi-Oh! was... A water deck based off of the cards from Fury from the Deep, which was the first water structure deck we got. And then, of course, the first deck I ever made being Equip Warriors. So, I bought three of these. I've already opened two of them. But I saved one just for you guys. And I will probably have an Atlantean deck profile for you guys up tonight. So, without further ado, let's get started. And obviously, when we get the Mermails next month, uh, these cards are going to be more playable, and it should be more fun. But, without further ado, let's get started. I don't care if I damage the box, because I already preserved one of these. Oh, make that two. <laughs> Alright. So, put that on the side. This is how the mat, oh, this is how the mat looks, by the way. I wish I could get these laminated or something. Sorry for the glare. Yeah, I wish I could get these laminated so that, like, you know, they weren't paper quality. Because I just love the uh, artwork on this mat. So we get a pocket-sized rule book. Yeah. Uh, play mat. Yeah, cardboard play mat. Or paper. Not cardboard, what am I saying? Paper play mat. Oh. And uh, here's what it says on the back. It says, Atlantis. Oh, it says, Rule the Waves. And then it says, Atlantis, a legendary undersea kingdom is about to rise again. And this time you will lead it to reclaim its ancient glory. As a new sea emperor, all the forces of the Atlantean army are yours to command. Infantry, archers, cavalry, and the mighty sea dragon called Poseidra. Remember, whoever rules the seas rules the world. And then here's what it contains. And yeah. Yeah, I'm obviously in love with this since it's water, but, uh, yep, here's the deck list. Um, uh, effects. It tells you how to use some of the cards. And here's the inside. Yeah, I mean, uh, you can use the Seal of Oricalcos, and I was thinking of doing that, but, uh, I don't think I will. I was also thinking of using Blue Dragon Ninja, but I don't really want to do that either. Although, and then obviously Abyss Rising, is that's going to be great for this deck. And then of course, the deck itself. Sorry for the lighting, I actually don't have the lights on in my room. Maybe I should have this on or not, I don't know, but... Sorry for the glare that's coming through my window. But I mean, there's so many... There's so many of these up on YouTube anyway. But I just feel like I should open one on camera. For the heck of it. Before I start making my deck. It's just gonna be a for fun deck. Nothing competitive yet. <laughs> Might have to buy another one of these actually. Alright, so here's Poseidra. Pretty cool card. Then we have Atlantean Dragoons. Call of the Atlanteans. Got your marksmen, heavy in infantry, pikemen, attack squad, which was in Return of the Duelist. Lost Brew Breaker. Kind of prefer the Seeker Rare version. Like, usually I don't like Seeker Rares, but that card pulls it off pretty well. Armed Sea Hunter. Spiked Gilman. Reminds me of uh, Command Knight. Deep Sea, Div Deep sea Diva. Nice reprint. Mermaid Archer. I was thinking of putting this in my deck, but I chose another card instead. Kadaris, Warrior of Atlantis. I think that card's an ultimate rare, and if it is, I definitely would want that. Abyss Soldier, I know that's also a super. Screech, Snowman Eater, Nightmare Penguin, Penguin Soldier. Deep Diver, Reese Ice Mistress. It's kind of funny to see that in here. I remember getting that from, I believe it was, yeah, it was uh, Gold Series 3. Mother Grizzly, Arabica. I kind of would prefer the super version of Philarabicas, or Rapicas, so if anybody has two of those, 
uh, let me know. Definitely want those. Uh, two uh, Legendary Oceans. Glad I have mint versions of these now. Terraforming, Water Hazard, Aqua Jet. Don't know why, well, I mean, I know why that's in there, but we just, it's not that old of a card. Still doing this. I meant since I'm recording this on my bed, the cards are gonna be shaking. Surface, Moray of Greed, Salvage, and if anybody needs salvages, let me know. I'm only running two in my deck, and I have two super rares already, so if anybody needs salvages, let me know. Dark Hole, which is always nice to have. Big Wave, Small Wave. Um, Aegis of the Ocean Dragon Lord, I think it's pronounced. Forgotten Temple of the Deep. Tornado Wall. Torrential Tribute, another nice card they put in there. Spiritual Water Art. Oh, I think it's pronounced Oif, the A is silent, I'm not sure. <laughs> Gravity Bind, and then finally Poseidon Wave. So in the comments section below, let me know what you guys think about the deck. I personally like it, obviously since I'm a big water fan, but... Yeah, I want to see what you guys think, and I'll definitely have an Atlantean deck profile for you guys, either... Yeah, no, you know what I can do tonight because I pretty much finished all my homework already. <laughs> so, that's a luxury of being a senior. You don't get too much homework. And what else? Tomorrow, I, I know I said last week I was going to put up a bunch of videos, and I apologize. I didn't. But tomorrow, I definitely will. I mean, this week, I definitely will. Like, tomorrow, I'm going to do a fa uh, NFL Fantasy update because my team's changed a lot, and I'm... Uh, I'm not doing well right now, <laughs> but I had fun playing with the family. That's it's always fun. But anyway, let's not get sidetracked here. Like doing something on my phone and recording at the same time, multitasking. <laughs> All right, so yeah, got my birthday coming up this Friday, so I don't think I'm gonna get any videos uploaded this weekend. Uh, I don't know, but yeah. I do have a CD collection, I did record my CD collection video, so that'll be uploaded this week, and I have other videos in mind too, but uh, let me know what you guys think about this deck, and you guys still have a chance to ask any questions for my Q&A video, because I haven't recorded that yet, still never got the chance, so yeah, enough of me talking, videos long as is anyway, I mean I know it's only 7, wait for it, okay I know it's 7 minutes 50 seconds, but still. Too long for a uh, deck opening, right? Anyway, thank you all for watching. Uh, rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye, YouTube.